And now comes the time of the truth. Ah, I'm so scared. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very interesting video and something very different from what you guys usually see from me. So I'm not going to do nothing fashion related, nothing beauty related, makeup, nothing. But I'm going to be doing something that's another passion of mine, which is coffee. Yeah! I just love coffee so much. I can't drink much because I get so much energy from it and I get a little crazy. But I really love the taste of coffee, I love the smell of coffee. And I have to drink coffee every day in the morning, I just love it so much. Other thing that I love a lot is to post coffee pictures on my Instagram. I love feed fillers, if you know what feed fillers are. It's the pictures I upload between my looks so I can get a nice feed. And here in Portugal we have some of the best coffees in the world but they are just not that pretty and that Instagrammable. So I thought I could probably recreate some and try to do at home. But the ones I'm trying today are not just pretty. I don't know if you have saw this before on Instagram, this trend, but there are some brands that have their own coffee shops, like Fendi has one in Selfridges, London. Basically, it's just a regular cappuccino where you have the brand logo on top, and I think that's very cool for Instagram, and I really want it, and we don't have it here in Portugal, so I'm gonna try to make it. So here's what I'm going to need. First, of course, coffee. We just bought this today. Then the second thing is milk. I was very uh, thankful to my best friend because she works in a coffee shop. So she made like a tutorial video for us and we are going to try to follow that. And she told us which kind of milk we need. So we went earlier today to the supermarket to try to grab that because I don't usually have fat milk at home. Uh, and if it goes well, because I'm not a pro, this is the first time, so we're going to follow the rules, but probably if it works out, I really want to try to do it with like soy milk or almond milk, so we can have an option without like animal milk. We will also need cinnamon. You can use cinnamon or chocolate powder, but yeah, I went with cinnamon. I think the color is more pretty for cappuccinos, I don't know, and I really love cinnamon. So yeah, I'm gonna try to use this to add the stencil on top. Also, another thing you need is, of course, the coffee machine. Also, for the stencil, we are going to need the stencils. I printed some because I want the logo to be perfect. And I printed a lot of different sizes. Then the last thing we needed was cups. So yeah, I really wanted one cup that was really uh, good for an Instagrammable coffee. And we went to Ikea earlier today and we found a lot of different ones. But we end up choosing one that I saw which was fully glass and transparent. And I think it's going to look so cool because you can see the coffee all the way down. Let's start. I'm so excited and I hope this is not a total fail. Okay, let's go. What I'm going to do now is just to use the cup that it's going to have the cappuccino on it to just put on top and see uh, which size is the best? I think the Fendi size is perfect. This one is cool. I think it could be a little bigger. Let me see if this works out. Yeah, I think this one is better. Yeah, I really like this one. I'm going to try to cut this. I haven't cut anything like this since I was in school. So yeah, this is so delicate. Okay, let's see. I was able to do this. Yay! <laughs> I think it's perfect. Yeah. Ta da! So, stencils are done, and now we are going to try to make cappuccino. Okay, so here we have the beautiful machine, and now the first thing we have to do is to uh, boil the milk, I think, and try to do a milk with foam. Other thing that I forgot is this baby here we bought in Ikea earlier today as well. What my friend told me is that we need a metallic recipient to add the milk and try to make the foam just because I think it's a temperature thing, I don't know. I'm not a scientist, but she told me metal, so I didn't have any and I went to Ikea and I bought this one. 
So she told us to add like half of the recipient of milk. I'm going to use the help from my boyfriend, but he doesn't want to appear on my videos, so just a hint. <laughs> Okay, so now we are going to add the coffee and then just put it here. <laughs> I'm doing a big mess. Okay, so we have the coffee press. Okay, now I need to turn this. <laughs> yeah, coffee is going out and it's smelling good. So I think we are nailing this part. So I have a coffee here and now this is the hard part, guys. So what she told us is that we need to add milk and then foam and milk and I think it's going to be the last part okay I'm going to try to do it with this we have to be quick okay so I'm gonna try to put here the stencil on top and just put the cinnamon on this is a little bit messy and now comes the time of the truth ah uh, I'm so scared. <laughs> this is a total fail. Are you kidding me? Why is this work? <laughs> oh my god, this is awful. Why though? Why does it have to be this way? I'm gonna try again. Maybe it has to be like less. I think it has to have more foam though. Oh my god. awful again do you think I can fix it why how do they do this I really thought it's going to be easy I bet they do this so fast and so easy and here I am okay maybe with some Photoshop <laughs> I think it's better now and now I'm going to try to take a picture it's not that bad on the picture I think I can make it work can you see it it's not as bad what a nice cappuccino, so hype, so cool. Yeah, I think we have a good shot. So, sugar, let's destroy the Nike symbol. Swoosh, bye bye, swoosh. Okay, let's try it. It's kind of yummy. Actually, it's a pretty good. I really love the cinnamon flavor. You wanna taste it? He's a coffee lover, so it's like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good, right? Yeah. Do you like the cinnamon flavor? It's cool. You can taste it just a little bit on the foam, but I really like it. It's really good. Yeah, it's really good. I'm really happy. Yeah, give me a high five. Yeah, we did it. Uh, I'm gonna try to make the second one on my own because on this one I had a little help. So yeah, let's see how this goes. My finger is getting a little cinnamon too. Well, I think this one actually looks better. It's not bad. It's not that bad. Oh my god, I'm happy with it. All right. No, it's great. Great, I wouldn't say it's great. <laughs> it's a masterpiece. It's a masterpiece. The only thing is that like the logo is not centered, <laughs> so that's not really good, but hey. Maybe if I hold it, it will look better. Yeah, I think this is a better picture. Okay, it's not bad. I think we managed to do two kind of beautiful cappuccinos. Uh, I think the taste was better than the looks. So we need to improve our stencil technique but in terms of taste, I think it was a pretty good cappuccino for our first try, so I'm pretty happy about that. You guys should let me know in the comments if you want me to try different stuff, maybe a mocha cappuccino, a pink cappuccino, a gold cappuccino, I don't know. Maybe I can do like the pink drinks of Starbucks at home, I don't know, let me know in the comments what you guys want me to try. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like me and if you like coffee. And I guess it's it for the day. Bye, Fendi.